Hi everyone, this is Julia from Adventure Geek and this week I'm talking to you about two brand new ultralight camp shoes that I've got for my feet for when you get to camp in the evening. So if that's of interest to you, then please stay tuned for this week's What's in the Box. camp shoes then so the what's in the box series if you don't already know is small little items that really don't warrant a full gear review and a lot of these things is stuff that I'm experimenting with and just showing you along my journey camp shoes is one of these things that's been a bane of my life from I think I've had these uh, these are like mountain warehouse shoes that I've had for absolutely donkeys. They're so worn now. Um, but I like these in the summer, but they get wet and they're quite heavy. They're about 110 grams. Um, so that's the first one. I've gone through Skinner socks, uh, which again are great, but they get your feet wet and they're not so good in the winter. And then uh, I saw Justin outdoors. Um, he does a lot of winter hiking as well and he was wearing down booties and then he was literally just putting um, carrier bags or you know like supermarket plastic bags or bread bags I think he was having over his shoes or so his booties down booties in the evening and I just thought that's a cracking idea so that's what I did on the southwest coastal path when I got back though I mean they ended up with holes in them and all sorts but when I got back I just thought there must be something out there that is similar to that that's probably a little bit more durable so I'll show you what I've got so the first thing that I've bought that I'm going to go over my down booties so these are just like the Sundick down booties I've had these for absolutely ages uh, are these so these are Tyvek um, just like shoe covers I thought you know we use Tyvek for ground sheets it's pretty durable and in the in the winter, I can just stick them over my down booties, similar way to which I was doing with the plastic bread bags. And uh, I can just pop outside to go to the loo or whatever and just sit uh, around the campfire with my friends, just covering up my uh, my booties. So I thought that was quite a, a good idea. So I've not really used them yet. So they're really cheap. Just got them from eBay. I'll put a link in the notes below. They were something like £3.49. Uh, I can't remember how much they weigh, so I'll weigh them now for you and I'll put that on the screen now. So that's the first item is Tyvek uh, booties. I don't know if that's going to work or not, but uh, they're not, they don't feel that durable, but we'll see how we get on with them. So that's the first item. The second item is then I was in the range, which is a, a, like a shop in the UK. And they got a little camping section and I thought, oh, that's a good idea. So I found these and again, uh, these are quite durable. I'll give you a bit of a close up. These are like shoe covers. Uh, and I just thought they might be quite cool to put over my down booties as well for the winter. So literally I can just whiz these on uh, and go out for a, a wee in the middle of the night or just sit around the campfire as well. Um, but they've got a draw string so you can tie them, pull them tight. Um, again, they are quite light. And again, I'll put them on the weighing machine now and I'll show you what, uh, what they weigh. Uh, price wise, I think these are about a fiver. So five pounds for the pair. Uh, and just uh, another type of camp shoe. So I'm going to try these out, see if that works. Um, I might end up, I can't do flip flops. I really can't do flip flops. I don't like things in between my toes. Uh, and I think Crocs are quite big and bulky. And I don't like things dangling from the back of my pack too much. So uh, I'm going to try these out, see how we get on with these. And I'll keep you posted. I've got a, a weekend adventure coming up this weekend. So we're going to give them a go this weekend. I've actually got these planned now, these videos. So next week's video is all about a nice new dinky little camp light that I've got that goes inside my tent. And I've got a new power pack as well. So I'll be sharing that with you. So stay tuned. If you're interested in this sort of content, then hit that subscribe button, ring the old dingy dongy bell. And I'll see you next week. Don't forget to get outside, get inspired. Go take a hike when you can. I'll see you on the next video. Take care, everyone. Ta-da. Bye-bye.